Okay, that was the wrong way. And if it's dead, I will lose in this woods forever. Oh, nice. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Katya and this channel is about life with four Brussels Griffons. Hello, hello. This video will be actually a vlog. It's very spontaneous. I didn't plan this video, it just happened. I asked my husband what next video I should film and he said just film you walking on a trail with the dog. I took my buddy Donnie, he's over there tired because we just came back from the hike and we went on a new hike it's about 20 minutes drive from my house and i never been on that hike before and i didn't know what ex to expect i use all hike <laughs> application on my phone and some people post the pictures and from the pictures i saw it have some water in there but i didn't know what exactly i will get so i took donnie and we went on a trail it was star trail very well on the old trail application, it's a map, so you can follow the map and it will show you if you're off the trail. There was people behind me and I like to be on the trail by myself if possible. So I went a little bit different direction. So they went to the right and went to the left and that's where our adventure start. So we walked and we went off the trail a few times and it's supposed to be loop, but my loop looks crazy loop and we lost few times and i didn't know where to go every time i go it map showing i'm off the trail that was kind of adventure it's trail supposed to be two and a half mile but it's turned out four miles for us but we saw very nice places we found a waterfall this is my first vlog so i hope it's not too bad <laughs> yeah so i try my best and uh, i would like to film more vlogs in the future because i like to travel i like to hike and i like to take my dogs uh, with me on my adventure so enjoy my lost in the woods i like this trail except the noises of construction trucks it's uh, kind of spoiled all joy of the hiking in the nature. I went off the trail a few times but it's all good so I found my way and I actually use old trail application and it's maps in there so if you go somewhere on the trail just download the map and you will find your way around the woods. So I'm walking on the trail right now. I'm walking somewhere in the woods. Hopefully I go in the right direction. Not so many people here. I follow this mark it's a white mark and so far it's been good so and on a map it's showing that i'm i'm okay i'm a good way it's actually the construction trucks they stop working which is pleasant because you can hear birds and a quiet nature which i prefer to hear every day so the hiking is my favorite activity i love to go on hiking every single day if i can uh, I like to go with my dogs without kids or with my whole family and with the dogs. I usually take one dog because to take many dogs, my dogs they bark a lot at other dogs and to make so many to take to so many dogs it's a bit um, difficult, uh, kind of stress a little bit. So and I like to go just with one dog. In my future goals it's a buy um, like a camper a trailer so i can hook to my uh, toyota and we can go somewhere places around america and find a good hiking place and actually i can travel with my dogs because right now we travel with the family but uh, lots of places they're not pet friendly like uh, apartments or houses where we're renting and if it's dog friendly it's usually very like basic um, plain house it's nothing special and my husband likes to go somewhere uh, more um, how to explain cleaner places like dogs dog friendly pet friendly is usually sometimes a little bit crappy looking houses so and he doesn't want to go i mean i can give up luxury if i go if i have opportunity to go with my dogs but he probably wouldn't if that's okay so um, maybe a few years it's like a goal we're planning to build a pool in our backyard and after that i think we can buy a camper so that's my dream 
uh, to buy camper and we can travel and also because I'm showing dogs I can go with all my dog to dog shows and they can stay uh, in a more comfortable like in the trailer we don't have to book the room if it's like summertime so it's kind of will be lots of benefits if we get a camper so I want to talk a little bit about the Brussels Griffon breed in my opinion in a toy breed it's the best breed ever I know everyone has a personal preference but I love Brussels Griffon breed it's a good companion you can walk with them for a long time you can go on a hike you can take them to the park walk you can take them to the lakes my dogs do not really like to swim but I never really introduced them to the swimming so that's why and uh, I know lots of Brussels Griffons they like to swim and they like to go to the oceans and lakes my dog's not really positive about that because well, they never swim before we don't have pool, we don't have lakes close to us so to the lake we need to drive and I don't know if you, they allow to swim in the lake so we have lake about one hour and 15 minutes from my house oh the bench will sit down <laughs> because my my breath kind of starts to break because i'm walking uh so yeah so it's about one and a half hour one hour 15 minutes the lake i want to buy canoe you know that inflatable canoe you can uh just um take with you in the trunk so that's my kind of plan and after we come back from vacation so we can go with my i will take kids and a couple of dogs with me and we can go swim on the lake it's actually a big lake and i really enjoy to be on the water not in the water i'm not really big fan of swimming i only like uh, snorkeling snorkeling like uh, when you uh, swim with a mask actually i need to get that before we go on vacation we're going on vacation to south carolina next saturday so it's 10 hours drive and unfortunately we cannot like take dogs with us because they're not pet friendly place where we're renting we, we looked for the pet friendly and we couldn't find anything around that area where we want to go unfortunately so that's why we need trailer yeah so we'll buy that canoe and i'm sure i can film some videos and some vlogs uh, on our adventure on a lake as well and i brought this little um, chicken it's a chicken bites by brent uh i think it's a primal I'm not sure I will look at home, but yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a primal treats. It's a very good treats. It's a freeze dry treats. I was giving my donut right now while we're on a break because he needs some energy. He's a big boy. He's bigger than either Brussels Griffon. He's about 14 pounds and it's too big for Brussels Griffon. Average size of Brussels Griffon, I think it will be a maximum 12 pounds. It's between 8 and 12 pounds. It's 12 pounds. It's a, like a um, higher level. Of the weight like for Brussels Griffon so my Brussels Griffon Tamara she's the smallest one right now she's a seven uh, pound 7.4 pounds and Hershey and Don I'm not Donny Hershey and Hooch he's about uh, same like 10 pounds so that's I think it's a 10 pounds the average uh, size for Brussels Griffon a lot of Brussels Griffons it's 10 pounds or 12 pounds you can see at the show rings different sizes but the average will be probably from 10 to 12 pounds right now i'm following this trail on the top it's actually pretty nice right now it's not hot i don't know what decrease I, when i left all was 19 celsius which is this amount in fahrenheit because i'm from russia and i used to measure temperature in celsius it's for me it's make more sense uh, it's easier to understand than fahrenheit fahrenheit it's complicated for me because i never learned fahrenheit if you watch my first video about hiking i was talking about eco-friendly poopy bags that's the poopy bag i use and it's no garbage here so i just put it in my bag i know it's disgusting but i don't want to carry my hands uh, i want a one hand free because one hand i have leash and other i want just for balance and i don't want to have poopy bag in my hand so i just put in my bag and by the way i use this bag so it's adidas uh, like a pouch and it's very comfortable and i bought new sandals let me just show you quickly what i have sandals my feet is mess because we went to waterfalls and it's muddy so this is my pants i'm wearing right now 
and uh, this is very comfortable this is my Donny Madoni that's his nickname and uh, all my dogs have nicknames and uh, my battery dying right now on my phone so I will keep walking because I don't want my phone die other way I will not probably find my way home <laughs> fast so it will take me longer than I expected okay uh, I will talk to you later probably at home already well I uh, oh, went off trail again so I don't know where I have to go. I keep going off the trail. It's okay. Uh, I think I found my way. It's a white trail again. So just go this way, and hopefully I will find my car. Oh, I mean, it's a nice walk. So I'm enjoying my walk, but I it's taking a long time for me to get back. <laughs> the trail I actually have to follow right now. It's a white pine. So, and I found this trail and on the map it showed me I'm going the right direction. Okay, that was the wrong way. So I went this way. Now I'll try to go that way. So hopefully that's correct though, because every time I go it showed me you're off the road. Oh, I'm a horrible hiker, but I'm enjoying myself. So I'm doing probably exhausted, but I think he's enjoying himself too. I think I found my way back because this is trail, the marks, yellow marks I start with. I hope it was yellow, not orange. Oh, because my phone right dying and if it's dead, I will lose in this woods forever. I don't want to lose my woods. Oh. When I begin to walk on that trail, I went off the trail and that trail was no dogs. I'm like, what is that? Walking in the nature and you can't take Oh, look. my dog almost fell. <laughs> my dog with me. So, but we changed the trails. Uh, we found a waterfall. I didn't know it's a waterfall here. It's a little bit waterfall, like tiny, mini waterfalls, but cute. And it doesn't say you cannot take dogs. It says you can not bike, but you can hike and take your dog. So which was like a pleasant addition to this trail. It's not all woods. Some part of this Look at this. Baby, baby, baby. Wee. It's, thankfully, it's not super hot. It's warm, definitely. So I'm wearing a long sleeve and I'm not dying. So I'm okay. Um, and I think I'm in a correct way as well. Every time I approach this markings, it's always different names of trail. I don't know. It's so unorganized. <laughs> organized, but I kind of clueless of what I'm doing right now. I try to find my way out of this woods. Hopefully I will. And I start to hear construction trucks. So maybe I'm on a correct way. And my phone almost dead. I wish I have a vlogging camera. I don't have to use my phone to film these videos and uh, drain my battery but that's what it is so Neil is my husband if you're watching I want a vlogging camera for Christmas thank you I love you you're the best man ever oh, I think they're looking for me my husband he's a firefighter probably it's not fire truck but anyway so my husband he's a volunteer and he's like oh my wife is lost I can't reach her let's take a truck and go for my wife oh no sorry Mm, not for me, don't. Too bad. Um, I don't know where to go. That trail show no dogs. Great. Oh no, wait. No bikers. Yeah, the straight, no dogs. To the right, to the left. No bikers. I lost again. Mm. Hiker. I'm a professional hiker, right. <laughs> well, it's shitty, but look at this beautiful bird. It's black and orange. Oh, so pretty. Oh, look at this, look at this. Hey, where are you? Okay. It's somewhere in the woods. Look how nice. It's like a little pond. Probably lots of frogs here. Yes, I can hear noises of jumping something in the water. 
that bird over there. He probably can see it, but he probably can hear it. I have to came, come here with my better camera and just take pictures. So pretty. Wow. A frog. Jump. Did you hear it? Did you see it? Frog. I'm not a big fan of frogs, but in nature it's okay. okay here's the tiny mini waterfall. And I think... Ah, oh, no, it's not finished. Okay, I thought like a trail finished here, but I think it's part of the trail over there. Hopefully, I don't want to die with my leg or neck. You am experienced right now. I lost, but I'm not regretting because it's so pretty here and it's not... Oh, my this thing flew in my eye. Ew. Oh, I'm okay. I'm okay. I just lost. Oh, my, my battery probably will be dead in a minute and I will lose forever. And you will never watch Katya's group videos again. <laughs> Me and Tony will lose in this one. So. Oh my god. I don't swear on camera and I try to not swear in my real life off camera, but fuck, I made it. Here's my car over there, somewhere. Yeah, it's right there. I did it. It was a beautiful trail and I definitely will come back again to explore. I'm sure it's a lot of trailers here. You can explore and enjoy the beautiful view. Well, look how I parked. Oh my gosh, it's so just a toaster. So we made it. We're in the car. Donnie, hot. I'm sorry, buddy. I didn't expect to walk for that long time. So I was think uh, it's only two and a half miles, and I walk in pretty fast. But this time we kind of lost a few times, and I um, I didn't take water with me, which is because it wasn't hot. So that was my mistake. So next time definitely will take water in the charger for the battery. Wait, yeah, for my phone battery, and um, definitely will prepare more. So I wasn't prepared, that was my first time on this trail. And yeah, I wasn't prepared, and I mean, Donny, he's not dying, he's just a big boy. He's also need a haircut, so which I will give him probably this weekend, because I feel kind of sorry for him. Yeah, so um, and now I'm going home. And it will add this video and this video will be out tomorrow on Friday. So that's the day I post. It's coming out, so my video is coming out to Friday 9 a.m. So in this place, I don't know, it's hard to see. I don't know, oh, where's the benches? Yeah, see, it has like a lunch area. Yeah, it has lunch area up here. Yeah, you can uh, kind of sit and eat your sandwich if you have sandwich with you. Lightning is disaster. So, but uh, yeah, uh, and I use my phone. Like like I said, I don't have vlogging camera yet. So hopefully get it maybe before Christmas. Maybe uh, like it's all like investment in expenses. So we just uh, wouldn't have enough. Uh, badges for that because I kind of start to make my videos again this spring and I like to do more vlogging because it's kind of fun when you walk with your dog or do some activities with the dog and uh, using the phone it's not always the best quality but at least I can give you some information and um, here's my buddy Donnie he'll probably rest uh, in the car while we're driving. It's not far from my house. It's about I would say 25-30 minutes But it's nice. Uh, I think it's so far It will be my favorite because they have lake, they have natural hikes with, uh, drive to, uh, They have hikes with the birds and uh, it's only one thing I don't like it's some trailers you cannot take dog with you but I kind of lost and have no choice just go in that trailer and just try to get through that trailer and they also have pizza place right by the trail so if you after you get hungry so you can stop and pick up pizza for yourself 
I live in South Park, PA, and I actually met Lamar. His name is Kenny. Oh my God! They killed Kenny! You bastard! Hmm. If you're in this area, just go on that hike. So you will really enjoy that hike. And uh, if you want to take your dog, take your dog. If you like. I accidentally go on that trailer where you're not allowed to take your dog and someone said, oh, you're not allowed to take your dog here. Say, you know what? I lost. Like, I did. I actually lost. So, And it's the only way to get back home to my car. I'm sorry, I have allergy. Oh my god, I will big sneeze. Oh. We made it home, finally. And I will wash my Donny right now because he is messy and my feet messy. So I will show you what I use. I use this silk Spain, Spana, this one, uh, to wash my dogs every time I'm washing them if it's not for dog show. And if I need to only wash uh, the feet, I use this cup. It's inside, it has like uh, this, I don't know how to explain, thingy. <laughs> Just put water, shampoo in there, and the wash balls in there. So I'll show you how I do it. I have this area where I wash my dogs in the summer. So if they, for example, roll in something on the backyard, or we came back from the trail and they're super messy, so we just wash them in this rocks, kind of. So for the paws, I will take this cup and put a little bit of shampoo to be super dirty. If not, I will just put water in there, put a little bit of shampoo in there and just pour some water that's plenty take my dog okay um i'll take he's, he's stubborn little boy take my dog and just put the paws in there and just move it like this and Repeat with all four. Come on. Hi, girl. It smells very good. This shampoo actually natural, and I don't worry about nature much with this shampoo because it's um, not. It doesn't harm nature that much. Like with the more how to explain unnatural shampoo. Yeah, and okay, I will give Donnie a bath right now, like a shower. Okay. Mostly his belly because his belly super dirty. So we went on a waterfall and it was a little bit muddy. Some areas in my feet actually. Yuck. I will wash myself with this shampoo. It's no problem. Okay, just his belly and his bottom mostly. I know. See, my dog don't really ugh like water much, but it's okay. And after two hours of walking in the wrong direction, I finally found my way to my car. And honestly, I was so happy I found a way because my phone was dying and my battery was very low. Like, and I wanted to film for you my experience of hiking and losing. Thank you so much for watching my video and please subscribe to my channel if you like videos about dogs. I post every Friday and please give me some likes. It's very support my channel. And if you want to see more vlogs like this, I see you next Friday. Bye.
Also, we'll, we'll 